of competition has come to a close. The nerves have settled for now, but the pressure has just begun because everybody still wants to know who made it to the semifinals. We'll find that out tomorrow morning. Now, hey, everybody, I'm Jeff Crabb, host of the World Championships with another great episode of The Daily Show. Right now, we're going to toss it out to Ia, who had a chance to catch up with a lot of the competitors here today. So I'm here with this cutie pie from South Africa, and we have Cameron with us. So, Cameron, how old are you? I am 10 years old. Um, how do you think you did just now? Uh, I think I did amazing. Because <laughs> when you actually think about the competition, it's quite big, and you just push yourself in. It's actually really nice on stage. It's before you go on, it's like so. <laughs> yeah. But when you actually perform, it's like, it feels like you're flying, basically. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here with Mindy from Team USA from the acting category. So how did you prepare for the competition? Well, I have, have a lot of support from my teammates and from my family and friends and they really helped me out with getting loose and getting on stage and getting my nerves taken control. So yeah, I just went off of everybody else and practiced and went up there and just went for it. I think we definitely saw that. How do you think you did in your acting category? I think I went really good. I was really comfortable. The judges were great. Um, I wasn't too nervous, you know, but sometimes you can feed off your nerves, so I think it was really good. Off with his head. So I'm here with Mandy from Team Australia. So how do you think you did in the competition? Um, I'm feeling pretty good about it. I feel like uh, I got into character pretty easily. I mean, once you get up there, it's just like it, it hits you and you just run with it. And how do you normally prepare for the um, events? Um, I, I don't really have a set schedule that I go through. I just sort of I get myself in the zone, feel out my character. I, I do like to write character profiles for all the characters that I do, just so that I feel like I'm familiar with them and I know exactly who I'm, I'm being up there. with George from Guatemala who's just competed in the dance category. And so tell me, what what kind of dance is this? This, I mean, you, you're all like, you're flashing everywhere. It looks awesome. Yeah, this is um, glove sticks and this is contemporary. Um, it's a hard work <laughs> because I took like three months to learn it. So, but I like it a lot. I think that I do my best. But uh, I don't know. I think I, I do it uh, like good. So I'm here with Sam from Team Australia, who's just competed in the dance acrobatic category, and she was just phenomenal. I mean, how do you think you did in the event? Um, I think I did okay. I like it. Yeah, I'm a bit hard on myself, but yeah, I'm quite happy. How do you normally prepare for this? Because I mean, it's what you did in there was really something. Um, I normally warm up for about at least 30 to um, an hour. And then for things like this, competitions, when you never know when you have to go on, you just always have to be ready. So I'm just constantly stretching my back and things like that. Yeah. here at the dance competition day two and I'm here with Caitlin from South Africa. So how do you normally prepare for your event? Um, I've been training every single day back home, uh, probably two hours in the morning, two hours in the evening, along with all the work and the studying that gets done. And then while we've been here, we've been training every single night as well, probably morning is three hours, four hours a day. Um, Kenya took the hip hop segments of those uh, boot camps and she really, she really helped us. She was so inspiring. She told us why she dances and why we should be dancing and she told us that there's a purpose for every single movement that we do. So you take that to heart and you put that in all your dances and it just, it, it helps you tremendously. Well, right now I'm hanging out with my beautiful co-host from Brunei, Jerusalem. Ia, you had a chance to catch up with so many great talents. The, the competition this year is fierce. 
It is. The talent pool is just humongous this year. It is. It's wild. Mm -hmm. Now, you and I, here's the big announcement, you and I are going to take over social media tomorrow. I can't wait for that. I'm excited. I mean, come up to us, follow us on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. We also do have a Snapchat, so that's at official with Copa. That's right, that's mm -hmm. right. So anything on those social media platforms is gonna come from us. I can't believe they gave us that power. I know. They might have made a big mistake. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking they possibly well. did. <laughs> Let's check out some more of the footage from today. Welcome back. I am here with the superstar himself, Jed Medella. So great to have you on The hey, Daily God. Show. So, so nice great. to be here. So nice to be back. Now let's talk about the semifinals tomorrow. You were here in 2005. You know the pressures going into the semifinals. What advice would you give to the contestants that make it to the semifinals for tomorrow? Well, the first thing that I always say is just start breathing. <laughs> start breathing. Yeah, because sometimes <laughs> they, for, yeah, they forget to breathe. Because some, sometimes uh, they get nervous, they get too excited that they tend to forget to breathe. Yeah. So just, just relax because, you know, it's just one step closer to the finale and uh, just just do your thing because uh, the, the reason why you got into semifinals is because you're good. That's exactly right. right. Hey, perfectly uh, perfectly put from the world uh, champion performer himself. Uh, let's talk about tonight. Tonight is a it's, a, it's a big night. There's a lot of people here, not just from America, not just from the other countries, but this is the night about the Philippines. This is Champion Circle tonight. That's right. Uh, I just want to thank everybody, uh, the World Championships, who, who made this the first time, right? It's the first time happening. So thank you very much for honoring uh, the winners from last year. Of course, tonight is going to be all about the Philippines. We, we prepared something very special for everybody tonight. It's uh, We called it talent and beauty from the Philippines. Uh, you, so you're the talent and the beauty? Is that oh, what it is? Of course. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know. Today is, is your birthday. Today yes, is your birthday. So it, birthday. that is an exciting time uh, to be able to be here at the World Championships on your birthday. You're going to perform. Everybody back here, just Jed Medella's birthday tonight. You know that, right? <laughs> Well, since you're going to be performing for all of us, mm -hmm. I think maybe we can do something for him. Are we going to sing happy birthday? Yeah! All right, one, two, three. Happy birthday to you. It's his birthday. Happy birthday to you. Hey, get a whole lot of sleep. We'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning. <laughs>